When it comes to fishing, he's the legend of Bimini, Willie James Duncombe, the oldest fishing guide in the Bahamas. And as you might expect of someone who's lived 72 years on an island, Willie can reel in a lot of stories in both the people he's met and the fish he's caught. Well, uh, I remember the um, biggest bonefish I've ever caught was with Sammy Sneed, the golfer, mm -hmm. and he weighed 15 pounds. <laughs> Bone fishing is something you can expect to find Willie doing nearly every day on this island. In fact, most people know him only as Bonefish Willie, but Willie wants to be known only for what he does best, guiding people like me through the island mangroves and searching for the best spot to catch a bonefish, the only fish Willie considers a true match for a sports fisherman. Well, because it's one of the fastest fish in, in, in action, it, it, it got more action than most fish. It's very wise. In fact, only one thing excites Willie more than fishing for bonefish, and that's fishing for man. Without Jesus, he would have gone straight to hell. You see, this small island community knows Bonefish Willie by yet one more name, Bishop Duncombe, the man whose calling is to save their souls. Good to you! It's a power from heaven. It's, it's, it's called the Holy Ghost. Take control of him. Lift him up. Turn you around. And send you right over the pews. Send you over the pews. I'm a sick! Lord! Lord! Good to me! Sometimes it can be hard to imagine this same person as your fishing guide, but Bonefish Willie always seems to find your fish. Yeah. Boy, oh boy, do I got a bone, John? Right. And that's what makes him such a fishing legend. All right. <laughs> okay, let's pose for this picture. John Holden for CBS News. <laughs>